Good Friday morning, SJSH, and here are your Friday morning announcements. I have a number of shout outs that I would like to give today. The first shout out goes to Gogi. Uh, Gogi, we got your email from mom. Gogi, you absolutely deserve a shout out. Uh, your mom and dad are so proud of you for working on your own, for always attending class and just being such a good boy. Gogi, we are so proud of you. I am so proud of you. Way to go. I love it. Keep it up. The next shout out comes from Mrs. Farrell and it goes to Zach. She says that he has been creating his own comic book. He started reading Dogman and was encouraged to write his own comic book. Zach has come so far in his reading and she is so proud of him. Oh, Dogman is such a good series. Zach, you're going to love the story. It's super silly, but it's super wonderful. I'm so proud of you for everything that you're doing. The next shout out comes from Miss Schumer, and she wants to give a shout out to her whole class. Uh, it says, you have all done an amazing job continuing to show our classroom expectations on Zoom every single day. You are kind, you are considerate, positive, encouraging, and respectful to herself, Ms. Schumer, and all of the classmates. She is so very proud of each and every one of you. Keep up the amazing work, and she says she misses all of you very much. Uh, something that was fun is Miss Schumer, um, she's in room five at the very end of the hallway. She stopped in to pick up some things and she actually conducted a class, a Zoom class from her classroom and her kids were so happy to see the class. They actually asked her to walk around the school a little bit just to see the school building again. And that was such a wonderful thing to see. So thank you so much Miss Schumer and Miss Schumer's class. The next shout out, it's really sweet. I've had a few shout outs that have come in for me. And although it's very sweet, I find it very awkward. <laughs> so, but today um, I got a really lovely email and it's from Laura McGinnis. And, she, and uh, Laura says, she really wants me to say the following. So I'm going to say it for you, Laura. Thank you so much. It says, thank you, Mrs. McKee for being such an outstanding principal, even in this crazy time. Thank you, Laura. I really appreciate that sentiment. It's very, I'm very proud of you and I'm honored to be your principal. So thank you, I appreciate it. The next shout out comes from Miss Cor and it goes to Anna R. It says, you are doing an, an excellent job in the data management class, staying on top of everything. She has also been so consistent and awesome since the very beginning of this semester. She is truly amazed by your performance, your participation, and your dedication. That's awesome, Anna. I'm so proud of you. Way to go. The last shout out for today comes from Mrs. Ramirez. She too wants to give a shout out for her entire class. They did a project that combined math, language, and social studies through the building of the Little Pigs house. They read the story, The Three Little Pigs. They talked about building materials. They had a budget for the, for the whole thing. And she was so impressed with all of the projects and she wants all of her students to get a shout out. So well done, Mrs. Ramirez's class. That's so amazing. I'm very proud of all of you. We have one birthday coming up on June the 1st and it goes to Kenner. Happy birthday, Kenner. I hope you have a lovely day on June the 1st. All right, now what everybody's waiting for is my pizza. So I'm starting with the grade nines. So today I'm pulling from the grade nines to give you a pizza. Um, again, I'm just really proud of all of you. You know, your first year in high school is, is a challenge just anyway, but then having to part way through the year, end up at home and do your classes online. Grade nines, I'm so proud of you. Way to go. So here is who's getting, here's who's getting the pizza for today from the grade nines. And it is Evan. Evan, we're going to be calling you shortly to see what you would like on your pizza. Next class is Miss Taurus's class. I, again, I'm just constantly amazed by all the things that you're doing. Miss Towers, you're an excellent teacher. We're so happy to have you on staff. And all of your kids are doing so well. I'm proud of the whole class. So let's see who gets pizza today from Miss Towers' class. And it's Murad. Murad, we're going to be calling you shortly to see what you would like on your pizza. The next class, Miss Kelly's class, our grade eights. Heading into grade nine, ah, oh, awesome. Of, again, I, I, I could go on and on about every class, but this class is just so wonderful. 
you know, we spend a lot of time preparing our grade eights and getting them ready for high school. You, your grade eights have really shown you're ready for high school next year. I have no concerns, no worries about you entering into high school. Oh, I'm just so proud of everyone in Miss Kelly's class. So here's who gets the pizza today. And it is, oh, it's, these are hard to grab. Brad, Brad, we're gonna be calling you shortly to see what you would like on your pizza. Next class, oh, it's upside down, Mrs. R's class. So Mrs. R's class, again, just a wonderful job. I enjoy seeing everything that you're doing. I'm so proud of all of you and Mrs. R, way to go. And oh, Mrs. R, happy birthday again. You had a birthday this week. So here's who's getting the pizza from Mrs. R's class. It is Lung Lung. Lung Lung, we're gonna be giving you a call to see what you would like on your pizza today. And the last class, so I chose five classes today. <laughs> the last class that I'm gonna pull from today is Miss Lewis's class. Again, you are amazing. I'm so proud of each and every one of you. Miss Lewis, you two are doing an amazing job. I'm so proud of you. Your kids are amazing. Let's see who gets the pizza today. And the winner is Marion. Marion, we're gonna call you shortly to see what you would like on your pizza. That's awesome. Well, everybody, I hope you have a lovely weekend. Uh, again, Fred and I are finalizing our summer plans and I'll be able to give you a full announcement and let you know about our, uh, our summer plans. Um, I hope you have a great weekend. I hope the weather gets a little nicer and that we can head it back outside. Uh, for now, you have a great day, work hard. Um, I'm so proud of you all. Thank you so much and you have a wonderful day. Bye for now.